So, do you know who called the police on me? Was it you? So there's a squadron of people waiting, I think, for the open part of the meeting to begin. It's actually fairly well attended, but I don't know how many of these folks are private, how many are bureaucrats, how many are reporters, so forth. Are you on the board? Why did you folks continue meeting for 15 minutes after the uh, non-public session was supposed to end and the public session was supposed to begin? Hi. Are you on the board? Oh, okay, thanks. Are you on the board of education? Okay, thanks. Mr. Duncan, why did you folks continue meeting for 15 minutes in private session after the public session was supposed to start? Why did you keep the public waiting for 15 minutes? The meeting was scheduled to start at 9 in public. Oh, yeah, I can ask you too, I guess. Why did you folks continue meeting for 15 minutes secretly? 15 minutes after the non, uh, after the public meeting was supposed to start. We were discussing items that uh, get prepared today, and occasionally we started a little bit after nine. No big deal. Every, everybody will be here. Have all their time. All right. Thanks for the answer. It's Dave. Hi. How are you? You look familiar, but I don't remember your name. School choice guy. Oh, hi. I remember talking to you at the state house. Yeah. I always watch you um, pacing down. Pacing up and down the halls in the yeah, state yeah, house. Yeah, that's me. You're a board member. Yeah. Oh, I've got a question for you. Was it so, was it actually someone on the board that just called police on me for being here asking questions? I have no, I don't even know who you are or have any idea what you're talking. Okay, that's good. That's probably the way it should be. <laughs> All right, thanks so much. Oh, I actually have a question about Common Core. Uh, would it be possible for me to get a copy of last year's Common Core-ish test? I don't know if it's officially Common Core. But... I think you, through the department, perhaps, or on their website. So they're not secret after they've been given? I don't know exactly. You'd have to ask above me. I'm just a District 1 rep. But okay. There's some stuff I know with uh, privacy rules, but I don't know how that plays out. I know they released results of, what was it, Smart Balance assessment yeah. recently. Yeah. Okay, thanks so much. What's your name? I hope Greg O'Dell. Okay, Mr. Dell, thanks for your transparency. <laughs> Are you on the Board of Education? I am. Oh, question for you. You're actually a board member. I am. Okay, question. Uh, actually, someone just called the police on me. Was it someone from the board? I have no idea. It certainly wasn't me. I certainly <laughs> okay, all right, thanks. Answer that question. What would I have to do to get a copy of the Common Core test after it's been given? Oh, I'm sorry. So first thing we apologize for being a little tardy. We we received one of our agenda items on our charter school. We just received right today additional information. So our responsibilities as a board is to make sure that the speech is being represented the black. So I apologize for starting tardy, but it's in the best thing. And to the empire for which it stands, one torture state under fraud, completely visible, with spying and lying to all. This is what the building looks like, in case you have as much trouble finding it as I did. You've seen the dramatic liberty arrests in Keene, New Hampshire. Now see 111 reasons why you should move there and reinforce these gutsy activists. Keen's advantages are compelling. For details, visit freekeen.com.